Hey guys, today I want to show you just a tip for probably my favorite healer in the game, um, which is Alex Straza. Alex Straza has the best early game versus a lot of the other healers um, in terms of short objective fights because of her dragon. Um, early pokes and trades, not so much because a lot of her value comes from her level 7 talent, Life Blossom, where she can heal for free. Um, until she gets that, her healing's iffy. But one thing that's very important about the dragon is that the dragon resets all of your cooldowns. So what a lot of people don't realize is when they see a fight going down over here, they think they should initially go into dragon form because that's going to be the most necessary thing for them. But in reality, what you should be doing is you should be throwing your abilities first and then you should be going into the dragon. And I'm going to show you a quick example of what it looks like. So I did 2,700 healing in a matter of three seconds, right? Or a couple seconds anyways. And the way that I did it was pretty simple. Um, and it didn't take any more time than just going in a dragon form. Because the dragon cast time is the longest cast time out of all of these. This, sure, it takes three seconds to go off. But what's happening is you're tossing your W first. You're giving a heal to ensure that they're going to last through the W. Um, and let me let me toggle cooldowns just to show you that it's not the toggle cooldowns that's resetting the cooldown, it's the dragon. So remember that the the W in here, it takes a while to go off, but if you know where your team's going to be fighting, which is the reason you're going to be using the dragon is you know where your team's going to be fighting, you do this, you do your W, and then you cue the lowest health person there so that they can survive long enough to get that W. Then you go dragon form, which resets your cooldown, and you drop down a W really quick again, and you toss another Q. This amount of healing is practically an ancestral healing early game. It's incredible. Uh, there's no healer who can do this much burst healing before level 10, and honestly, after level 10, there's very few who can do this much burst healing. So again, just to show you the combo, it's this. And it's just a huge, huge chunk of healing very quickly. Uh, don't forget that in Dragon Form, you heal everything that you do. You just can't right-click on your own target. So you always have to be attacking an enemy. Um, if you're curious about when to pick Alex Straza, she has a few maps that are really good. But if essentially maps where the objective is early game, as well as team comps where you have heavy melee on your team that can abuse the fact that you have these giant heals. Uh, if you have any other tips for Alex Straza, feel free to leave them in the comments below. Thank you.